Hello Tauruses! Welcome back on my YouTube channel Ivana Tero and this is monthly love tarot reading for July 2023. I can't wait to do your reading because this is summertime. What happened? What happened? What happened? Taurus says in this month of July you can expect the very best love of your life person who will bring love, harmony, peace. This is very charming person. You can expect new love. Bam! So there you go. So we already set the tone of the month of July. So Taurus says welcome to your new love. Welcome in arms of person who only can bring harmony, balance and love. So big chances for new love. Big chances. Way to go. Way to go. Taurus says way to go. Alrighty. Now let's ask tarot cards when this will happen. Obviously in this month who they are. Oh my, the very first week of July between Friday and Sunday it looks like that or around July uh, 16th I think you will fall in love again and you know this time it looks like you have big chances you know to get to achieve exactly you know what you want. Six of Wands you will tie the knot with this person. This new love, this new person in your uh, in your in your life, you know, represent you know someone who who is very honored, you know, respectful towards you. And usually six of wands also represents love at the first sight. Who they are? Eris Leo Sech. It looks like that. So listen, listen up. When this person approach, or maybe this person already approached, you know, to you, but maybe nothing, you know, happened in the month of July, finger crossed, you have much more better and bigger, you know, chances than the previous, you know, months to start committed relationship. Page of Cups. Message after message, message of love is coming your way. This person is very, 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 very impatient. This person will buy to you a lot of expensive gifts and you will realize you know like it means you know something you know how come this person is willing to spend so much you know time you know with me and you are right you know Tauruses you know you are right Eris Leo Sage Cancer Scorpio Pisces so new love is a promise in the month of July page of cups this person have been watching you for some time watching watching you almost spying on you asking your friends their friends about you you your life are you single are you attached and they will realize oh my you are valuable and then this person will simply start you know chasing you all around but you will realize oh my this person is not bad two of swords what took you so long before you hug me, before you kiss me, before you approaches to me. This person was uncertain. This person was not like insecure because this person is anything but insecure. This is very, very powerful person. Down to earth. What this person want, usually you now they get it. So in this month, of course, they want you. But you might be a little bit... Um, I think you might withdraw for a couple of days because you think it's in vain. It's not in vain. Taurus says, you know, believe me, this is not in vain. In vain. This is such a beautiful chance for love. Eight of Cups. If you have, you know, some problems, you know, some of you might really withdraw, not for a couple of hours or for a couple of days. Maybe you want to withdraw for a couple of uh, weeks. Maybe you need to think, maybe you need to overthink about something. Some of you need solitude, but I think in the month of July this is end of your solitude because there is a new love. It looks like you have been waiting for quite, you know, some time. So you need, specifically you need, you know, something, something which will last. 
you don't want to invest yourself, you know, into a relationship which is, um, you know, in vain, a person who don't want to commit. It looks like they won't and it looks like they will. So, you will actually, you will re-evaluate your feelings, but I'm telling you around 6th of July or 16th of July, this will hit you so strongly, you know, and some of you also need to decide should you stay or should you leave. So it looks like first week and in the middle of this month, you know, uh, you will you will know what exactly you want to do. Exactly. This is you making a big decision. Big decision. It's a justice. I call this card a boomerang. If you're happy, you know, this person, if this person is making you happy, you will be even more uh, willing, you know, to give, you know, a lot of, you know, love, you know, back. So basically everything depends how you feel in this relationship. Libra, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces could be important in this month. Aries, the Sag most likely is a new person, right? So, uh, and also some of you will have more than just one chance and some of you will try to keep, you know, those suitors at the arm, you know, length. Like, wait a second, I need to think but try not to overthink, you know, too much because usually, you know, chances, you know, come and in some time they are gone. Surrender. This is what you should do, honey. You should, you know, surrender. Allow destiny, you know, to decide instead of you whatever this actually, you know, means. So, surrender. I know you can do that. After all, you are Taurus. You are smart. You are very spiritual. You are down to earth you know what you want and of course you know what you do not want so for a change for a change because usually because usually you know Taurus people this is at least my idea you want to do something you want to um, arrange you know rearrange but is in this month surrender and you know you will see allow this person to fight at least you know a little bit you know for you so yeah this is exactly what you should do uh, because you want to find out is it worth it and how much this worth it actually, you know? This person will beg you, don't give up on me, I am a good person for you. But you know this person in some way needs to earn you, right? You want a person with the feet on the ground, you are ready, but also you will go slow. So you want this person to show a little bit, you know, they are chasing you around and they will, and they will. King of Wands, bam! What I want, I usually get, and this King of Wands seriously wants you. It's a fiery sign, Aries Lee Sage, and I mentioned also could be Cancer Scorpio, and one very, very persuasive Libra. So King of Wands, what he wants, he will get, and in the month of July, this King of Wands simply wants you. But actually, I don't see any type of, you know, drama. For the first time in your life, you will surrender to this new love. You simply what you want. You want to be seduced by someone because usually this is your, this is usually your idea. You need to do, you know, a lot of things. But not in this month. In this month, surrender. This King of Wands will seduce you. So month of July will bring you new love, new person, new passion. This person is honest to the core, making fast, bold steps towards you. Four of Cups is something which is bugging you at least a little bit. Relationship with someone could be something, you know, unfinished. You need to learn how to address to your past. You still need to learn how to ignore, you know, someone from your past. So if you think too much about your past, it certainly means you still love your ex. But I'm telling you, you know, this is, you know, exactly something with the Eight of Cups, uh, something that you should, you know, leave, you know, behind your back. This person will make you happy. This person will love you. I'm telling you, Tauruses, you have the best ever chance to be happy. You have the best ever chance to feel harmony, peace, and truthful love you can spoil this month by crying and you know insisting on 
your ex and this person brought to you nothing but the misery. Even though you don't believe you have a chance, I'm telling you, Tauruses, you have big chance and actually this could be your best month ever for harmonious, committed new love. Four of Swords, stop analyzing, stop already, you know, thinking and thinking again, should I, could I, would I find peace inside of you, allow this person to arrange everything, okay, so this is the month of love and clarity, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, one of your best months ever, two of swords, two of pentacles, could I, should I, would I, you can do whatever you want, you can do whatever you want, but two of pentacles, like two of swords, is saying, I can't do this, you know, in such a fast, you know, pace, I need to think, I need to rethink, I need to, honey, don't do that, just surrender, because this person will do everything what it takes to keep you in relationship with them. One of your best readings, I'm telling you, Tauruses, comment, like, share, subscribe, if you want, schedule private reading with me. God bless. Bye.